Many Americans are introduced to guns by a family member. Though not all introductions are like this. Not too far from Reno, Nevada, the annual Father's Day machine gun shoot is a celebration of firepower, the fully automatic kind. It's very addictive, too. <laughs> I, mean, I, I did it for the first time just a couple years ago, and, and I immediately wanted to, I just, I want to do that more. It's just exhilarating. Yeah, it makes you, it makes you feel really alive. Here, the entire family can shoot everything from AK-47s to classic World War I machine guns. It's a rare opportunity that draws gun enthusiasts from all over. Todd Green and his two sons have traveled over 200 miles to do something not allowed in their home state of California. This is a, a heritage that's passed down from father to son, from my grandfather to my dad to me, and now I'm passing it down to my kids. Walk up and point to something, and that gentleman will help you. We will take care of you. Want to try that one? Easy. <laughs> as long as you're willing, able, and 12 years old or older, you can fire a fully automatic weapon on the Mustang range. Okay, whenever you're ready. Yeah, that was my first time firing a machine gun. At first, I was a little scared when I fired it, but then it's got getting kind of used to it. It's pretty fun. It makes me feel very alive. For these enthusiasts, the thrill of rapid fire bang bang is worth the price of admission. Some of these guns can fire off 50 bullets each second. My first real gun, I think. 15 years old is when I had my first lever action. I started off with the little stuff and um, I slowly worked my way up. That was the M11. It's, it's a lot of fun because it's like, it's like the grasshopper from Men in Black. Everybody like, it's the little one but it has a lot of power, so. I have about 60 firearms. The ones on the table behind me are all fully automatic weapons. And they're a lot of fun. The reason I began to invest in guns was this. I found out about the fully automatic weapons market. Fully automatic weapons go up in price no matter what else happens in the world. Law of supply and demand. As of 1986, no more weapons that are fully automatic can be built. So there is a finite number. That number stopped in 1986. So they can't go down in value. About five years ago, you could buy an M16, new in the box, for $8,000. As of this date, that gun goes for $20,000. So they just keep going up. I know lots of people like to picture terrorists in their minds when they shoot, but I have none of that in me. I'm a total, absolute pacifist. But obviously, I appreciate my Second Amendment rights. And I appreciate the fact that that's going to pay for at least half of my grandchildren's college educations. Hey.